YouTuber, it's Deanne Love here and today is my birthday so we are going to jam. Now if you've never been to a hoop jam this is kind of how it goes, either the music goes on and everyone just busts out their moves or sometimes it's just kind of like hanging out and chatting while you're hooping and other times you're like oh wow cool nice move how do you do that? That's kind of a hoop jam. Now our hoop jam on YouTube and because it's my birthday I'm just going to kind of rock out some moves and if you want to follow along when I turn up the tunes then we can jam together. So let's start with a bit of a bookie on the waist. This is our center. So we're really going to shift it right here. So feeling the pulse forwards and backwards, side to side. Let's get the 360. I want you to move those shoulders, move your arms, move your chest, move your legs, and just keep the pulse in the belly. Now we're going to go around in a circle, however you feel. Might be a spin, might be a pivot, might be a little step. Just rocking it out. Now we're going to send that hoop in the opposite direction. Are you ready? Because it really is day seven and we're still working out. Jamming but working out. Let's go. Opposite direction. Still feel the ease. Make it groove. Round in a circle. However you feel. Woo. And when you're ready, back in first direction. Now I want you to kind of glide your shoulders side to side. Lots of movement, lots of dance. Let the hands float and fly. We're going to look for new space with our hands. So we're dancing with our belly, we're pulsing with our belly, but we're also dancing with our hands. So I'm going to look for space up and space out, <laughs> space out, and space inside. So we're just going to have a little jam with that sensation up and out and down. Cool. However, it's just your expression. Keep those feet moving. You might like to do the hand dance, the arm dance as you're going in a circle. Up and out and down. So up and out and down. Woo! Now we're going to take those hands, we're going to keep dancing but with the hoop off our body. So grabbing the hoop and taking it up, going around the body. This is one of my favourites. Let's jam it out. In one direction and then the other. Still keeping the movement in the body and then we're going to go halfway and halfway. So you might like to get a little hip pop or shoulder and the hip roll around your lower back like a massage. Whoop. And we're going to keep the hoop in the front and we turn one way and the other. Cool. Let's spin. And so while we're spinning, just on the hand, this is one of our most basic moves. I want you to keep as much movement in the body as you can. That might be one hand in one direction, the other direction, both hands. This is fun one. You may even propel and spin, or your second hand that doesn't get all the action. But just thinking equally intelligent in both sides. And playing, painting shapes, circles, spin and dance. It's that easy. That's why it's a jam. <laughs> No rules, just play. Woo! Now let's just go for some weaves. Forwards, maybe backwards, maybe the 360. You can remember that one. Nari did a really cool tutorial on that earlier in the year. 
Woo! Weaving to the front. Or you may like to go front and back to the side. Down low, up high. Woo! Second hand if you wish. Two hands. Backwards. We're just jamming out here. No rules. Love it. Let's push it into some isolations. This is where you get to totally show off. Bring it on. Any kind of ISO that you know. There's so many, so many, so many. <laughs> Let's go for it. I remember when I first started learning isolations, I thought like, whoa, they're so hard and everything hurt. <laughs> but now they feel really smooth and really soft. And they're magic. <laughs> so, moving through your isolations. Ah, just playing. Anytime that we stop and feel like we're making a mistake, like, oh, my isolation is not perfect. Like, oh, that wasn't even an isolation. Oops. When we stop, we give our body and our mind the message that we're doing it wrong, and you're never wrong. It's all right, it's play. We get to do whatever we want. We're coming to the end of our jam, so short. Little birthday jam, so rock it out. I wish I could see you. I can kind of feel your energy, but I just want you to go for it. Where is your hoop heaven? Chest, hands, neck, on the legs. What do you love to show off? Now's your time. Mandela's. If I didn't have lights up above, I'd be totally rocking them out right now. Woo! Whoa. Yay, thank you so much for having a hula hoop jam with me on my birthday. Super cool fun. Now, how did you go with the seven day hula hoop challenge? We did a workout every single day from New Year's Eve right up until today. I'm sure you totally rocked it out. But if you happen to miss any of them, all you have to do is check out this YouTube channel. You can totally subscribe or head on over to hooplovers.tv because I have a list of all of the exercises for every day of the seven days on our workout challenge.